Oh, there you go. I'm not eating. Why not? It's lunchtime. I'll eat when Mommy gets back from California. Well, Mommy has to stay with Grandma till her legs heal. She might not be back for another two weeks. So, I'll wait. You're gonna get real skinny and your head's gonna get big and you're gonna be like, looking like E.T. <laughs> Come on, baby, eat your food. It's your favorite. I had that cereal for breakfast. I know, and you ate it so well, I made it again for lunch. I only like the prizes. Good, because I happen to have put another prize in here. What's in there? Well, if I told you, it wouldn't be a surprise. <laughs> Dun, 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 surprise! Put shoe in my food. Yeah, they're called funky feedios. They're loaded with vitamins, minerals, and toe jam. I may never eat cereal again. Come on, baby, this is fun. I haven't been having fun since Mommy went away. Well, look, this is fun. Look, this is a, a talking shoe. Hi! Can you tell me where my twin is? <laughs> it's fun, baby. Come on. I don't want any cereal. What do you want? I want something healthy. Like what? Pizza. Pizza. I think I could do that. Dad, the garage is clean. Right. Is it junior clean or is it dad clean? It's hospital clean. Is it county hospital clean, or is it Mayo Clinic clean? Is eat off the floor clean? Is it you eating off the floor clean, or me eating off the floor clean? Dad, it's clean. I don't believe you. Go look for yourself. Okay, now I believe you. Thank you. My work is done. There's no more work to do. No such thing as no more work. A good worker creates work. Dad, I'm exhausted. Fine, go take a nap. I can't take naps at home. I can only nap at school. An algebra class. You were supposed to take me to the mall ten minutes ago. Everybody over there is waiting for me. Am I the only one who cares about Claire? Apparently, yes. <laughs> Nobody can love you like you do, Claire. Well, you could at least try. And what's with all these naps? It's ridiculous. I love when you guys take naps. Because you're unconscious, you're laying in a puddle of drool, you're not complaining, and I know exactly where you are. That is my definition of perfect children. Yeah, well, I have my definition of a perfect dad, and it's not you. Me too. Me too. Oh, really? So what is your definition of a perfect dad? I'm not telling you unless it's in the safety of a family meeting. Yeah, where well, there are no repercussions. Yeah, no repercussions. Do you even know what a repercussion is? No, but I don't want one. Okay, fine. You want a family meeting? You got a family meeting. Right after you take your naps. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, you two don't take naps. meeting has officially begun. If you have any gripes, you're free to let them out without fear of repercussions. Hey, I'll go first. Ever since Mom's been away, you've turned into a dictator. That's not true. Off with your head. <laughs> Look, okay, maybe I have been a little stricter since your mom's been away. But that's because if I let up, I know it's gonna create chaos with you guys. We haven't had an ounce of fun. We haven't even rented a movie in weeks. It's just been naps and work. That is not true. What about the big picnic we had the other day? What big picnic? You ate a sandwich, we mowed the lawn. I think I speak for all of us when I say, you're being a lousy father. Who are you to tell me I'm being hey, a lousy no father? Repercussions. No repercussions. Yeah, no repercussions. Of course. Okay, you know what? You're going to get away with that because we are under the confines of the family meeting. And Junior, since you've got the biggest mouth and head, it's not a repercussion, you're just full of ideas. The ideas take it way out here. And you got a lot of ideas right back in the hook area. Why don't you go first? You tell me your definition of the perfect dad. First of all, 
you'd be the biggest rap star in the world. And we'd be living large. Yo, I'm the coolest thing over 30 since puffing the roots. One of the kids' father wrecks platinum tools. My son drives around in my Lexus coupe. Yo, this house is his. I live on the school. Yo, there's my son now. That's Junior Chris. <laughs> Where's my drink? Thank you. And where's my Cuban? <laughs> right here, puppy. <laughs> I'm into cigars. Yo, what's, what's up? What's up, man? What's going oh, on? You the macaroni and cheese. Teach me, man. You, know you holding it down? I'm holding it down. Next to you, I'm a clown. Word is born, kid. Word is born. Hey, servant girl. Yo, you heard the man. You heard the man. Hurry up. Yes, big brother, Junior? After all of this is over with, I want you to clean it up. Yes, Big Brother Junior. Then I want you to go in my room, kick the two honeys out of my bed, and make it up for me. Yes, Big Brother Junior. And stop calling me Big Brother. What should I call you? <laughs> your Highness. Yes, Your Highness. Bounce. Yo, I love the way you dominate your sister. I mean, you know, I want to do that to your mom. Yeah, that's my sperm manifested. Oh, he is a living Adonis. He is beautiful. Oh, look, freak. <laughs> Don't get too close to me, all right? I'm a player. I love a man who disrespects me. <laughs> so we can go upstairs and I'll tell you what a filthy, nasty little girl you are. Sure. Then after that, I'm going to tell you that you are good for nothing. Hold it, hold it. That's your fantasy? I'm a big rap star, but you get all my girls and abuse them? Yeah. <laughs> And in your stupid mind, that makes me a good dad. No. Makes you a great dad. Did you ever treat a woman like that in real life? She'd slap you upside your big, lumpy head. <laughs> and a woman hitting me. <laughs> you see, Junior, your values are all screwed up. You want a rap star as a father? Well, let me tell you what that would really be like. First of all, yo, Junior, get out here. Yes, Dad. This is your son? Yeah. How can that be? His head looks like a boulder. Is he missing a phone with song? Could be. He got three nipples, too. Are you cheating on Mom again? No, I'm not cheating. I'm going to hook your mom up, too. She's fine. <laughs> Why, you got a problem with that? <laughs> no, dog. Take it easy. Okay, don't be calling me dog. I'm sorry, Dad. And don't be calling me Dad, neither. What should I call you? Call me the Grand Pooba. <laughs> okay, Grand Pooba. So what you doing in the kitchen? You getting high? No. Why not? <laughs> I'm doing homework with Allison. Yo, who's Allison? Did I hit that yet? Did I sample that? No, that's my house little sweetheart. She's the girl who in the marriage. Oh, my God! Is this your dad? You didn't tell me your dad was P. Daddy the Nap Master. I'm your biggest fan. Tell me to take a nap. Fly down. <laughs> no, not there. Upstairs in my bedroom. I, I thought we were going to get married. Why would I want a broke, big-headed nerd when I could have this? <laughs> well, you ain't going to have nothing. This is mine. Excuse me? I'll fight you for him. Wait, Honey, wait, I wait, take wait. All no, I don't no, know no, 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 Ladies, ladies, ladies. Y'all need some space to fight. Go ahead. <laughs> all right, all right. That's enough. What's the matter, Junior? You don't like my version? It's just that I've been working on that one for years. <laughs> now i got to come up with a whole new fantasy. <laughs> all right. Whose bubble do I burst next? Hey, come here. I want you to tell me what kind of daddy you would want me to be. That's easy. The best daddy in the whole wide world? Mm-hmm. Whoa! You're gonna get in trouble. You're gonna get a spanking. No, not my daddy up here. He's the best daddy in the whole wide world. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Hello, Mr. Kyle. <laughs> oh, me, oh, my. Someone made a spilly poo on the floor. <laughs> I'll just get my super-duper sweeper friend, and we'll clean this mess up in a hurry. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, my. Hey, let's sing.
sing the happy sweeper song together. <laughs> I love my broom. <laughs> my name is Bill. He helps me out. When there's a smell. <laughs> Come on, let's do it all together. <laughs> Yeah, that's cute, but it might not be cute all the time. Why not? Well, imagine this. Daddy! Daddy! <laughs> hey, kitty, why all the salty tears? She fell off the swing and scraped her knee. Oh, me, oh, my. We'll just have to sing the happy, happy song and make that little boo-boo go away. No, I need Nero's forehead. Oh, no. You just need to sing and dance. <laughs> when you scrape your knee, <laughs> just dance with me. <laughs> we'll twist and turn <laughs> till you forget that bird. <laughs> Come on. Something that's not funny. Oh, sure it is. <laughs> you can stop. You're not You're not <laughs> Oh, you think I'm obnoxious, huh? I wonder where they go. <laughs> My plan is working fine. Afraid to show your face? Right, Claire, you're up next. Okay, but there's no way you can ruin this one because it's all about me. <gasps> I'm shocked. Hey, Junior. Oh, hi, Dad. Where's your sister? She's upstairs. Oh, Claire! I'm home! I'm not coming down there if they're not with you. Oh, silly, of course they're with me. I wouldn't be a good dad if I didn't bring home the number one boy band in the country <laughs> who I happen to manage. <laughs> hey, and these guys are not just the flavor of the month, either. What are they called? Chocolate chip. <laughs> and you guess which one is the chip. Come on in, guys. Ah. Hey, what's up, Creston? <laughs> Thaddeus? Chip? <laughs> Hi, Claire. Hi, Claire. <laughs> All right, guys, let's talk about this upcoming tour. I figured we'd hit Mike. Don't talk about business when this beautiful creature is here. I'm sorry. Please don't fire me, Justin Creston Blake. <laughs> you look ravishing today. Extraordinary. No, stupid. No, Claire. It's like the dew on a beautiful morning. No, nope, when the air is filled with honeysuckle. Mmm, <laughs> Claire, with the beautiful hair. Hey. When she walks by, you have to stay. Hey. Take me away. I don't care. As long as Claire is there. Okay, that's a good fantasy. It shows a lot of imagination. But it could go another way. Hi, Hi Claire. Claire. <laughs> hey, all right, guys, let's talk about this upcoming tour. I think we hit Mike. Don't talk about business when this beautiful creature is here. I'm sorry. Please don't fire me, Justin Preston <laughs> Blake. Did Mike cut the hat through? We like Mike. He's our favorite little man. man. Wanna pinch his little kid? We love Mike. Hey, they signed the checks. <laughs> it could happen, right? It may come as a shock to you but the world does not revolve around Claire. Is it safe? Come here. Daddy was just kidding. <laughs> Come here. No, no, no. Sit down. It's my turn. Now I'm going to describe to you my fantasy of perfect children. <laughs> Bring it on, Dad. Okay. See, in my fantasy, you are all mature, responsible, Delightful little children. Hi, Daddy. Hello, sweetness. Have you finished all your chores yet? No, silly. A good worker creates work. There's always something to do. 
Besides, I'm energized. I took three naps today. I know. I'll go upstairs and spend some more quality time with my sister. Young people need a strong role model. And a good sister is an after sister. Bye, Daddy. Bye, sweetie. Brother! Sister! <laughs> Hi, Junior. How was your day today? Oh, it was a blessing. Let me tell you. I was out spreading the good news of God's kingdom with all the neighbors. I ran from three dogs and got lots of doors slammed in my face, but I'm happy. Do you know why? Why? Because it's the right thing to do. Hey, why don't you take some time off from your busy schedule and watch some television with Oh, me? no! That's the devil's playground. TVs, movies, video games, it's all bad. I'm gonna go upstairs and get an article for you right after I take my nap. I'll help you with your homework, Junior. Thank you. <laughs> And look at this. I love you. Hey, there's the door. I wonder who it is. I'll get it. Why, look, it's Dr. Klieger. Boy, have I got some great news. I got the results of Katie's test back, and she's going to be this little and this cute the rest of your life. Wow. Just like Gary Coleman. That's fabulous. This is the best news a dad could ever have. <laughs> so what do you think about that? That's a fantasy, all right? It's stupid. It wouldn't work, Dad. And why not? Think about it. What would happen if all of us were perfect? Hey, Junior, come on. Let's go shoot some hoops. I'll teach you that turnaround jumper. Oh, no, Dad. I have no illusions about my abilities at the game of basketball. <laughs> so if it's not a part of my overall life goal, why pursue it? Well, what about exercise, son? Oh, I get plenty of exercise on the cheerleading squad. <laughs> I'm the captain, you know? Yeah, none of the fathers let me forget that. <laughs> um, what about, what about schoolwork, son? Oh, it's great. I have full scholarship to Harvard, Princeton, Brown, and DeVry. Wow, DeVry. So I guess that means... Yes, um... your job is done. Congratulations, Dad. You've raised a wonderful son. Well, at least I still have Claire. <laughs> Hi, sweetie. Oh, I was just on my way out. Were you going to the mall? No, I went to the mall where I ran to Junior handing out watchtowers in front of the gap. <laughs> and I decided to join him in his missionary work. We're moving to Guam. <laughs> you don't have to worry, Dad. The only thing I'll be spreading is the word. This is terrible. <laughs> Can things get any worse? This is my fiance. What up, dog? <laughs> You're joking, right? No. He understands me. He completes me. Don't worry, man. We're going to give you lots of grandbabies. What you talking about, mister? That's not good. Mm -mm. It could happen. I think we ought to call the truce. I think that sounds like a good idea. And I think we should all agree that we're pretty good people the way we are. Uh -huh. That's right. You bet. Look, guys, I know I've been overdoing it since your mom's been away. And it's because I just don't have the same qualities that she has. I'm not as patient. I'm not as sensitive. And I'm not as nurturing as she is. But I'm trying. You know, I'm doing the best I can. And maybe I need to try a little harder. You guys are right. Let's, let's have some fun together. Huh. I don't know, let's go put on some old clothes and go out in the driveway and play car wash. I'm not buying that. Hey, what? What do you guys want to do? I want pizza. I want to stay up late and watch movies. I want the girls for my fantasy. <laughs> Can't do that, but I know chocolate chips number. <laughs> Pizza's here. I'll get it. Hey, 
I got three pepperonis here. Is this the right place? Hey there, cutie. So what did you decide, Clark? Are you to kill me? The Smallville season finale. Tonight at 8, only on the WB11. This is terrible. Can things get any worse? <laughs> so dope. You're joking, right? Come to eat. We're gonna have a lot of fun. <laughs>